and St. Charles Parish welcomed new parish leaders and some returning ones during the inauguration of 10 elected officials this morning. After overcoming hurricanes and tornadoes, the parish president says they are stronger than ever. WGNO's Ashley Hamilton has the story. Leaders in St. Charles Parish took the stage to be sworn in, ready to continue addressing the needs within the parish. Parish President Matthew Jewell was sworn in for his second term, saying the parish will only evolve more than what it has. We're able to advance a lot of projects forward. Uh, a lot of them are under construction now, and a lot of them are coming up under construction in the next six months to a year. So we're excited to see uh, the progress continue on into this next term. Through the pandemic and natural disaster the parish has overcome, Louisiana Senator Bill Cassidy says it's been remarkable how they've worked through those challenges. As Louisiana's insurance crisis persists, Cassidy plans to continue working with the leaders in St. Charles Parish as many are still working to rebuild. We're working very hard for reforms to the flood insurance program that will make it more affordable and more sustainable and more accountable. We're working how do we reduce the risk of flooding uh, and we're doing that through the bipartisan infrastructure bill which we would make everybody in the parish safer. As he embarks on the next four years, Jewel emphasized it'll be his administration to help him along the way. My executive staff, appointed staff, our civil servants all do such a great job making sure that uh, we take care of this parish and, and turn my vision into uh, a reality. Ashley Hamilton, WGNO News.